Hello. Welcome back to Ratchet Gladiator. So, uh, first part, we uh, got introduced to the whole arena thingy. And now we are in the swamp, uh, getting shot at by these monstrosities. Uh, I'm playing on hero difficulty. So, those scorpion alien things can literally kill me in two shots. Uh, for now, anyway. Until I level up. Like, a lot. Let me just kill these guys real quick. Vipers are nearly leveled up again. Here we go, lovely. Another speed mod on it. 25 power. Oh boy. I need more nanotech. Ow. Please die. Please. Please die. Oh, that's so tough. about to get more. Nope. Oh boy. Yes. Mo health. They still kill me in two shots. So, yeah, this uh, Hunter Mine Launcher actually does some pretty good damage. I, to look. Uh, I need ammo. Just, just, just so desperately. Okay. Let's blow this bitch away. damage. Okay, we're on nearly at the end of the challenge, so thank god. So yeah, this is basically Annihilation Nation. Um, it's a game, really. So uh, your wrench in this game is no longer called the Omni Wrench. It's now the Versa Wrench Light, and you can buy new versions. So that gets stronger. In your suit gets stronger. Lair, Team Darkstar must capture three control nodes. Your weapons get stronger. You get stronger. As do your teammate robots. Basically, everything in this game is upgradable, and I think that's probably why I like it so much. Because that just tickles my pickle, that does. Let's buy some mods. So these are on Omega mods. And these literally change how your weapons behave. Oh, it's the right stick, that's why I couldn't steer. be a good opportunity to get some more nanotech. I do love a good vehicle section. It's another thing people don't like. Let's blow this bitch up. So 
so I just wanted to get out uh, just so I can um, get a weapon XP because obviously where I'm playing on a harder difficulty I need it I need the XP I need the power I need the health because if I get too far in the game without having upgraded anything really uh, I'm going to die in like one hit I should also be going for skill points so I'm going to have to come back and get them later however I may actually leave it for a bit wait till I become powerful and then uh, go for skill points ow Crank that boy. I think I can actually destroy my own vehicles, so I probably shouldn't do that. But yeah, I've just put an acid mod on my uh, dual vipers. So now they actually poison enemies, basically. So yeah, uh, so just in case anyone hasn't seen the first part, I'd fully recommend going back and watching it. But uh, the story of this game is, uh, obviously Ratchet has saved the galaxy three times. Uh, but elsewhere in the galaxy, completely different system to the Solana Galaxy. It's uh, basically an underground illegal gladiator fighting arena, which is what we're in now, which is televised. He's completed the first and uh, they kidnapped Ratchet to put him in it. <laughs> so it still has the classic Ratchet Clank humour. Uh, it's just it just plays differently. Uh, you don't get to use Clank. Clank is a supporting character in this game, so you can't. I think you can glide later on. Uh, where am I even going? So you don't have the heli pack, uh, the thruster pack, the hydro pack. In fact, I don't think you actually go on the water at all in this game. Uh, what else don't you have? I think you can get charge boots. And you can get a glider. A uh, way to glide, which is the charge boots. Before the epic showdown with the King Leviathan, Team Darkstar must hack all the orbs to wake up that big fella. Happy hunting! Mmm, I am breathless with anticipation. Sure you're not oh, just boy. breathless because you get to sit up here next to me? No, but that does explain why I'm feeling nauseous. Burn. Okay, this does, because it's because of the mod now, it does a lot more damage. Which is good, because these are piddly little pea shooters and they only really become good once you uh, max them out, really, once you evolve them. Okay, you know when I said they do good damage now? Uh, I changed my mind. I do like these guns though, I like the whole dual wielding gangster sprayer style. <gasps> That's a point! That is actually a cheat in this game. Uh, gangster guns. Yeah boy. <laughs> so now we hold them sideways when we shoot like a fucking G. So we are fighting a boss. Small boss. That just nearly 
absolutely annihilated me. Ow. Ow, I'm dead. Oh heck. So I've got to get these guys to hack these little orbs on the side. So those are my battle bots. They, uh, they help out with my teammates. They hack stuff. They can move the uh, bolts. Uh, you latch onto and unlock the cranks. Uh, they're immortal. Basically, they go down. They go back up straight away. Uh, I'm dead. They can be upgraded. Pretty sure they can actually also shield me. But I was going to unlock that. Which, when I end up back at the base, I'll actually have a look at doing. Just want to see if I can upgrade my armor. Because, yeah, these things kill me in two shots. Which, uh, spoilers, sucks. These are nearly B4. God, these things take so much damage. B4, baby. Not enough to uh, evolve yet. But it's still an improvement. Here's Big Mama. Oh, she's out. And she's wearing armor for some reason. They kitted this thing out, didn't they? I am weighing into this thing. Oh, I need more ammo. Ow. Oh, please die. She's dead. Did it. That was tough. So we just got a new gadget for our battle boys. The cable launcher. Which is a very useful gadget. If you want to gain more experience or earn more bolts, you can return to any challenge you have already completed. So we got hover bike race. A landstalker level. Okay. What skills we got? Okay. I'll come back and do them some other time. Uh, let's do this because I want my money. Okay. Noted. Can't jump over them. Jump them ones though. Whoop. So yeah, this is a this is very different to the uh, original free Ratchet and Clank game. It's still got the exact same sort of gunplay, but basically the whole game is based around gladiator challenges. So it is literally Annihilation Nation, the game. A lot of people didn't like this one, but it's still a very fun game. Denied!
I've got two skill points for that. Nice. What do we get? No peas allowed. Complete any challenge without using the dual vipers. Okay, fair enough. Complete any challenge without using the B6 splitter eight or a magma cannon. Yeah. Okay. Swamp fever. Red Zone has unleashed an angry pack of Leviathans for Team Dark Star to battle. They'll have to destroy them all before time runs That's out. That's my battle, boys. Man, even the land stalker struggles to kill them. Christ, no wonder. Yeah, no wonder they were messing me up. I do like the land stalker. I want one. Skill point, so yeah, skill points in this game actually give you bolts. has been destroyed. Oh god, I'm not sure if you'll actually be able to hear that in the video because I don't know how fucking loud this game is going to be. It shouldn't be too loud. It should be just loud enough. It should. Mortars on this are basically my best friend because they just do so much more damage than the piddly little cannon on it. Okay, I need to kill two more. Nailed it! Oh yeah, boy. Boom. Right, let's head back. Let's see what we can get now. So yeah, this this game isn't actually all that long either. And now for a Vox Sports update. Dreadzone's extermination of the day award goes to Shellshock for his 360 Tomahawk finishing move on Plutonium Jones. It was a beauty, Dallas, and it marks Shellshock's third extermination of the season. At fourth, actually, the Omega Twins count as two. Good points. And we're now live with Shellshock for comments. Shellshock? <laughs> Those Omega Twins went down like wee little girly men. <laughs> wee little girly man. <laughs> Especially since they were actually teenage girls. <laughs> yeah, ironic. Hey, Juanita, are you wearing Ace Hot Light underwear? <laughs> and now for a heartwarming story in entertainment news. Courtney Gears has made a remarkable recovery. Uh. After a near-death experience last year when she was attacked by two psychotic fans. Ah, poor girl. You know, you just hate to see that kind of senseless violence. It's a calling, Dallas. I'd just like to take those two creeps and... <laughs> I'm sure we all would, Juanita. And you may just get your wish, because those very evildoers are about to come face to face with the mighty Shell Shock. Catch it all live on Dread Zone. Hey, we have a promotion match coming. Wait, he's first? I thought Reactor was. Guess not. Hmm. All right, uh, okay. I guess I'll just buy both of them. Yes, yeah, so I will configure mods. So I think instead of that, I'm going to change that to shock. And I think on this, I will equip that. On this one, I will equip the napalm mod. Can I not put a napalm on this? Really? 
Okay, fair enough. And we are full of ammo. Right, what else can we get? Can we buy some upgrades for our boys? For myself, perhaps. What have we got? Shield link. Ooh. Yes. Now they can actually help me. That stands for responsibly removing your robo bar wrappers. This place is a mess. So I guess I can't get any armor yet. All right, so we got rank of me. Get your stats up, contestant. Thirteen thousand. I am still at the bottom. For now. So we got battle dome. Let's have a butcher's. Let's see what we've got here. Rest of the mill. Hmm. Okay, so there is a skill point for these. Get ten enemies in a row with the same weapon. Kill five enemies without taking any damage. Okay. Five up. <laughs> One. And that's that one. <laughs> so the enemies in the newer locations, or the older locations rather, are actually easier than the ones in the newer places. So if I struggle too much, I can come back. Nice. Okay, what other skill points we got here then? Eagle Eye, 75% accuracy without taking damage, medic speed demon less than 60 seconds. Okay, 15 barrels, 5 swarmers in one shot, which I can do now. If they appear. Damn, son. Better to use this. Oh, not they're all dead. There will be multiple opportunities for me to get that skill point, though. God dang! That's pretty much out of ammo. Held it. And I took damage, so I missed out on their skill point. Right at the end as well. Lame. Ah. A sleep, I guess. Five and one. Here we go. Nice. Oh, baby, I love that smell. Daka, daka, bitches. Let's try and get the uh, seventy-five percent accuracy one. So yeah, this is uh, combat in this one is absolutely fucking bananas compared to the older games. Like, some of them are balls to the wall, hundreds of enemies in one go. It's great. 
Why did that kick me out? When you are ready to choose where you are going to compete next, enter the planetary transport. Rude. Yeah, my dual vipers are getting stronger. I think they're V4 now. Also means they're near evolving. But yeah, in this one, I think at the start uh, you can get weapons up to level 10. Oh, yeah, no, I think I have to get them to level 10 in order to get them to evolve. And then in challenge mode, I can get a mega var variance which Look, got to like level 100. Ratchet will fight to keep Team Darkstar alive while Clink tries not to get him lost. What? Clink? Clank? Well, Clank, that's what I said. Well, you know, it doesn't matter because Team Darkstar is about to become Team Dead Star. <laughs> oh, will they survive long enough to enter the foreboding Dark Cathedral? If so, Shellshot will be there to finish them off for good. Place your bets, everybody, because we're going straight to the action. You can tell that guy had a lot of fun with that voice. A lot of fun. The cathedral is completely locked down, but I ah, fusion rifle. Looks like a sex toy. What are those? Oh god, no, these enemies are annoying. Can I get on the turret? Ow. Yeah, I'm nearly V5, nice. this gun. This is the PS3 version by the way. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Take that dropship. How to teach you to buy things and sell them more expensive elsewhere. Nice, help boost. Getting some slightly respectable health now. Yeah, that is. Oh. So that's the magma mod. It's quite fun. He didn't give me ammo for. Yes, uh, what is there a fucking echo here? Eh, eh, eh. 
Shield them during it while they're doing stuff. Oh, fuck a bit, me. Little asshole. That's one. <laughs> oh, we actually fight Shell Shock now. Okay, fair enough. But I think this is the proper fight though. So this is, for me, basically a promotion fight. My gladiator rank will increase if I kill him. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the one, the only, Shell Shock! My little furry man! <laughs> He's also my favorite one. Pretty sure he actually does a runner when he gets a lot of half health. I've just noticed the shells coming out of it, dinking all on the floor. That's a nice touch, especially for a PS2 game. That's pretty fucking advanced. That is a separate model. Eh, Grand Rail course. These are actually quite fun. That's not a dual bypass, well. So I want to get this upgraded uh, because it is actually very helpful to have because of the amount of ammo. I don't want to use the Hello Shield launcher, it's shit. Will do. These are odd models from Russian Clank 1, these things. I don't know. Ow. I just wanted this. So now you can actually aim and shoot this time. Oh, hell yeah. Five. So yeah, it is, it is ten levels. I think there's actually a skill point for doing this without taking damage. And no way I'm gonna be able to do it until much later. I have some absolutely murderific guns. Man, man, man. 
annoyingly, the Tall Vipers are actually the only thing you can use on the uh, Grand Rails. Which is why it is pretty useful uh, to get them upgraded. This is a long Grind Rail. Fuck it hell. Oh, made it. Ta da! Darkstar lights up the spotlights that will unlock the Dark Cathedral of Kronos. A treacherous path lies ahead as Dread Zone's deadliest warriors will be waiting to ambush them. Oh, baby, I love this job. Ratchet, there is a magnetic lift up ahead. It will take you up the road that leads to the next stadium. Thanks, Clink. 50k. How much have I got? 47. Okay, not bad. to take that bullet to the side of the face. Fucking hell. Oh, that shield launcher might be a good idea. This one's actually pretty good when it's leveled up. And it actually tells you when it's about to run out. Where the fuck did that miss? please. for something like this. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, he fucking had it in for me. 
Fusion rifle. Fusion rifles are a good long-range weapon, which can be zoomed in to accurately shoot enemies from far away. <laughs> Ammo mod, nice. Increases the capacity. So we are actually becoming slightly stronger. What the fuck are you shooting me from there? Dropship as quick as possible. These bastards. Time. Oh boy. Oh, uh, frames. I don't remember this fucking doing this on my first playthrough at all. Oh boy. Did it. Nice, now I shall have a nice, refreshing Coca Cola. I think. Not sponsored. I wish. They got loads of money. I'd happily take some off their hands. Cathedral was easy. I did? Well, that was then and this is now, huh? Team Darkstar will have to fight their way through a series of increasingly deadly arenas. Bet they didn't see that coming. Uh, oh, yeah, baby. Okay, we are currently full on ammo. How long that will last, I don't know. Initiate the annihilation program. Sweet way to clean. Pretty sure this isn't the actual fight, you killing them. I think that mine's still chasing him. Oh, 
that it? Really? I thought it was going to be more than that. Team Dark Star is on the final stretch. This road leads right to the gates of the Dark Cathedral of Kronos, but it's chock full of twists, turns, and baddies that'll make you mother weak. Uh. Let's go to the action. Ammo, please. Should upgrade my magma cannon. There we go. Level five now. Nope, level four. Come on. Oh, I got scratched my eyes. Oh, that's better. Oh, that was actually making my eyes water. That's how fucking sick this shit was. Oh, for some I missed the rail. Yes, this is a bad time to mention that I'm afraid of heights. You can fly. Mission granted. Let us continue with these boys. Cheating game. They were way too close together. You fucking shit. That's bullshit. He was out of my range, but I was fucking in his. I was robbed. Ow. That's half my fucking health. Son of a bitch, that was the wrong row. Fuck off, you go first then, you mug. Oh, I forgot you can do that. The hunt on mine. You can literally just run into enemies a bit out. Yeah, as long as you've got a weapon equipped, you can literally just run into enemies. They'll explode on them. Like so. Get him. <laughs> Cow patties. Take our pardon. Talking about poo poo in my videos. I guess this is a bad time to mention that I'm afraid of heights. Be a 
Lag be good. Lag. Friend rate. So I'm not emulating this at all, but this is actually how the PS3 version of it. It's uh broken. Slow motion. No, it wasn't actual slow motion, it was just frameless. Okay, jump like a motherfucker. Got it. Ow. That bitch fucking shot me before he even loaded in the game. Okay, I actually dodged that one this time. Tootsies. Fuck those guys. Fuck this heat. Fucking Melvin. <sighs> so fucking sweet. I haven't moved. I haven't done anything today. I woke up, played video games, and that was nearly 12 hours ago. Ratchet and Plank humor. I would deserve my dishonorable discharge. Did you know that Shell Shock was recently named the sexiest robot alive by Mark's magazine? Oh, that hurt. or not, he's a little bitch. See? Keeps running away like a scary little puss. Believe enemies come out of that. You should check out the shield link feature. Just press the right directional button to have one bot create a shield around the other one. Beautiful. So I can go up there, but I need mag boots, which I don't have. C. I can't remember how you unlock them. I think it's an item you get for doing a certain challenge. with someone's face. Oh, that fucking hurt. Pussy! How many times that he's run away from me now? Five? Little bitch. And this is on the difficulty below the hardest difficulty in the game. Because I hate myself. That's basically what challenge mode is in this game. Uh, so you do your normal playthrough on the difficulty that you choose. And then when you complete the game, uh, you can then go into the next difficulty. Let's just fucking do that. I want 
no part of your discharge, please. I will, sir. I will thank you to keep that to yourself. I need ammo. I need a lot of ammo. It's okay, he's beating out again. Still need ammo though. Last one, I think. Yes. Initiate annihilation program. Oh, I can't feel my leg. Oh. Yeah, buses in this game pretty easy. Just strafe around them now. Jump over the attacks and jump over. Getting closer and closer, and then it just went pop. Bitch ass. Bitch. Nearly killed him. Wait, what? You keep progress? Apparently so. So, can I? I've got to go around. Things make me go around. Oh, I'm sticking to my chair. Ugh. Yeah. I do keep my progress. Be able to weigh him in now because I still got most of our ammo. Initiate annihilation program. Bring it on, bitch. Gotcha, bitch! So I don't think he's actually dead. Oh, I got a charge bridge. Look at those idiots! 
it's cheering. Six million bolts of hardware down the drain, and those ingrates are celebrating like, like, like I won the freaking lottery. Uh, remind me why I put up with these morons. Who else would watch Vox News? Temptation Asteroid? Galaxy's Funniest Decapitations? Yeah, yeah. Queer Eye for the Tyranoid? I get it. <laughs> Seems we've underestimated our Lumbax friend. He got lucky. Shellshock was too slow and too stupid to be an exterminator. He should have been retired years ago. Well, he's retired now. Ratchet, however. Huh. He just may be useful. He's even more popular than you were back in your heroic youth. Come to think of it, he even reminds me of you. I said he got lucky. His luck won't last forever. Try it, bitch. Anyway, I'm going to leave this part here. So we just kicked the crap out of Shell Shock. Uh, I have been promoted. Uh, actually, I don't know. No, I haven't. I haven't been promoted yet. I have to do the championship thing, I think. And then when I get promoted, I get access to other challenges. And those are what gives me the blue medals. Which is quite cool. So. Thank you so much for watching, hope you've enjoyed. If you have enjoyed, feel free to subscribe to the channel, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Mind how you go.